What? The people here. They're smiling. Uh, <laughs> it's true. Oh, look up there. The house with the weather vane. That's ours. Oh, right above the market. Yes. The view will be amazing. Brushes and combs from Firenze. Try them. Why not change your hairstyle? Thank you, but I like it like this. Oh, good for you. A woman's hair is her righteous crown. Beautifully said. Your hair is nice like that. Well, thank you, sir. For your father, maybe. He's dead. But he loved this wine. Uh, well, he was a very fine Fresh man then. The he was. Helps Thank you. Spurs. This is some really beautiful furniture here. I had a closet like that in my room. I like to hide in it. <laughs> of course you did. Look at the colors. Just imagine the clothes you can make with this. The most beautiful clothes, you can be sure. Shoes. Are you interested in any? Yes. <laughs> I'm interested in too many. Bombs, ointments. Oh, marigolds, primroses. Oh, you know your herbarium. Only flowers. Shoes. My mummy taught me. Sandals. We kept them in a book at home. Do you want to buy flowers then? Thank you, but we like to pick them in the wild. It's our thing. I understand. Enjoy. Yes, come, let's see the rest. Sure. Fresh fish from Corsica, caught this morning. Every four freights gets your fifth for free. Loops, the finest. Yeah, this mackerel's so fresh, he's flapping his fins. Tuna. Sardines right off the boat. Come play. It's free. A gift to our visitors from the Count of All. A game? What do you say, lady? You look like a winner. She is. <laughs> All right. So how do we play this? You get four shots to knock down as many cups as you can. Got it? I'm in. Ready? Like the fur back home, Amicia. Easy. Go! <laughs> yes! You're great! That was close. Keep going. You hit a lot. Of course I did. What did you expect? You're our best player today. And you didn't even use your sling. I think we have to get going. Thank you. Goodbye, sir. Come play. It's free. A gift to our visitors from the Count of All.
Well, his parents must be dragons. A man dragon! Exactly. I'm sure Lucas could spit fire too. Of course. He's perfidious. Is the cattle fair still on? We should be there already. I heard they have some sick animals over there. Oh, well, we better wait then. See our house. It should be right up here. Oh, we can share my room if you want. Don't you want your own? Mm, I don't know. But that way we could invite each other to our rooms. Yes, I love this place. <laughs> Me too. I'll see you after my watch. All right. You sure? I keep you on duty all the time. I know. That's just how it is since the Count gave the Captain more power. for us. I wish we could stay a bit more. We'll come back. <laughs> the people here, they don't seem to know about the bad things. Bad things? Everything that's happening outside. I think they do know. They just feel safe here. You will too. Hey, I'm going to put you down for a bit. <clears throat> Let's pick up the pace. Yes, I can't wait to see the house. I wonder how big it is. I just hope they have real beds. I hope I can see the market from my room. A king's room, of course. Of course. <laughs> Someone's had a long day.
You're back. So how was it? They've got everything. <laughs> it's true. We'll have to go back all together. Sure. We need some fresh herbs. Look at that. I think we can call it home. Yes. Home. I haven't said that word in a while. I'm glad we came. <sighs> and I think someone needs to take a nap. I'm not tired. <laughs> sure. Let's go see inside. This is our door. Ooh. It looks quiet. And it's less hot here. It's nice. Ready to come inside? Yes, lead the way. We're home, Hugo. Our new home. Let's take a look around. Mm. Yes. All right, we'll do that later. Mother, where's Hugo's room? He's exhausted. Upstairs, the bed is ready. Thanks. Come on, you sleepy beast. You must come, Amicia. Come where? He'll be healed there, too. Healed? Well, that would be nice, I'm sure. It will be. You're thinking too much. Sometimes it's better just to trust your feelings. I'm trying, but I... I get stuck in the logic of it. Substances obey natural law. The macula does too. You don't need logic, Lucas. You just need to be human. Maybe... <sighs> I'm just not very good at being human. You are. This is why you have doubts. today must have woken it we had six months of respite after he passed the second threshold but the balance of his blood is very delicate Amicia go with Lucas Magister Rodin is somewhere in this town find him and tell him to come quickly right away Amicia I know we'll be careful It's because of those farmers. I should never. Oh. It's not your fault. How can you be so sure? You can't control what happens in his blood. The macula keeps evolving, pushing the carrier through different thresholds. Will this Magister Vodan really help? The Order has been studying the macula for centuries. If they can't, I don't know who can. Lord, protect him. Why hasn't Vodan shown up already? I think he's just being discreet. The order works like this. Someone must know about him. Let's ask around. Here, a town guard. I'll ask him. Uh, hello? Excuse me. Would you know the whereabouts of Magister Vodan? Uh, I've heard of a Sir Vodan, not a Magister. Try the marketplace. There's a couple of florists there. I think they deal with him from time to time. Thank you. Good. That's a start. I should have known. Of course he doesn't go by his order's title publicly. We came by the florist earlier. It's somewhere around this marketplace.
You're sure you remember where this forest is? Hmm. Maybe we could ask someone. Hello again. Oh, it's you. Looking for flowers for the little one? Actually, I'm looking for Sovoda. I believe he's one of your clients. He's my husband's client. He's the one who deals in medicinal herbs. Oh. But Morton should be right by the fountain. Just tell him I sent you. He's wearing a brown tunic. Brown tunic. Thank you for your help. Let's hope he tells us. He will. Excuse me, sir. Your wife sent us? Now, what does she want now? I'm busy cleaning this mess. It's not for her. We must find Savoda. Him? Well, he doesn't like to be bothered. Just like me. Listen, my brother is very sick. We need him immediately. Oh, all right, all right. I don't know precisely where, but I think he lives close to the arena, down there. Don't tell him I sent you. Don't worry. Thank you. Right, let's not waste time. The arena district. That's a lot of houses. How are we going to find him? There's mischief in the air. I can feel it. Yes. That's why I keep the children inside. It's a slum. The order's not poor, so what would a magister be doing here? Probably hiding? Probably. <coughs> Amicia. That symbol on the wall. The order? Yes. He's in here. No one gets in. The arena is off limits. Why is that? Because the Count of Provence said so. Get going, please. Listen, I really need to pass. It's all right. Come. We'll go around the arena. <sighs> Now's not the time to argue with soldiers. Let's look around. You're right. Sorry. There's a door up there. Yes. So, ready to break the law? Come on. <clears throat> Is it? The bite, yes. They've locked the arena down. They let them die here starting all over again not starting spreading hugo we brought it here let's find magister voda if he's not dead already i can't believe they left him to rot here these people look poor they must be from the slum outside Notice their disappearance. Maybe nobody cares. Maybe. Here, another symbol. Well, let's get in then. You think the symbols will lead to him? Yes. Look, an opening up there. There must be a way to climb up. This could help. I'll give you a hand. If Odan's here, he's in trouble. He knows the bite. He must be avoiding the sick. Lucas, if all these people here were bitten, it means... <sighs> Maybe not. A sick person could have brought it inside the city.
time in the world just talk to me please let me go that brute is not a soldier but he's dressed as one not a single coin no how many are there a man. if i find him i could ask for a reward amicia he'll see us i'll make him move thank that bastard count for letting you die like a dog Damn, that's an ugly death. Huh? That's it. Go away. What's making so much noise? No. <laughs> Please, no. Up there. Looks like it leads back inside. Let's find something to get up there. Oh, quick. There's some sort of half cart here. But it's not high enough. I think they were moving the bodies with it. Oh, that cage up there looks the right size. Uh, it's full of bodies. Oh. Don't look at them. Let's push it. It's a massacre. We brought it here. We condemned them. It's still going on in Guyenne. It's already spreading. Yes, but they would have seen it coming. It wouldn't have changed a thing. Oh, no. Don't eat them. We must get out of here. So many dead already. Like it's one step ahead of us. Yes, 
but none of them look devoured. Look, I think they were keeping count of the dead. They left a knife. It's stuck. Come on. Yeah. No. Well, let's keep going. Through there. You don't use blades against people. I did. I had no choice. A blade is silent and quick. It's what we need now. All right. It's up to you. fell ill, it means some must have been bitten. I've seen no signs of attack. Not yet. Anyway, let's go. Expecting more soldiers. Where are they? We're the almost out of here. We did. 
But I'm weary of the thieves, murderers, mercenaries, all the bloody scum that keeps getting in our way. Chaos rules our lives. I see it. You didn't leave much alive back there. Yes. That's probably why we're still alive to talk about it. 